Welcome to Relate to Document Experience platform. In this video, I'll show you how to get started with Relate to. The first step of onboarding is to get signed in. To sign in, click login in the top right corner. As shown, you can sign in using either your unique email address and password for Relate to, or using your LinkedIn, Google, or Microsoft account. Now you can select which account you want to work with, which could be either for a specific company or for your personal projects. Each account will hold documents specific to that account. To switch to different accounts, all you have to do is click on the top left corner and click on different accounts. Now that you know how to access your account, it's time you learn how to actually make use of Relate to this platform. To start working on a new document, click the plus button at the bottom of the page. As you can see, you can choose to upload different types of files, but for now, I'll choose to upload a PDF file as an example. The next step is to choose which view you want for your content. Relate to provides multiple formats and even gives recommendations on what would best suit your document. Once your document has been created, you can choose the title, privacy settings, and description. As you start editing your document, you will see an option to set up the format of your navigation bars, which Relate to automatically generates with the AI. You can also add new navigation bars you want by using the call to action button. Here, I've created a home button by using a go to page action and a home icon. Once you've added your menus, you can also start adding images to your document by using the Add Interactivity button. Get an image from your computer and feel free to change the size and location of your image. You can also add a video to your document, and here I chose to add a YouTube video and I set it on a loop. Once you have multiple documents and want to organize your work better, you can also create a hub. Click the plus button again and choose create new hub. To add a new file on a hub, all you have to do is click on the plus again and find the document you want to include in the hub. Now you're ready to use Relato on your own. 